Hello, dear ones. I know it's been a minute since I've actually done a one minute word. It's been a holiday and we are crunching toward the end of 2020. So we're going to start with the first things first. So since now at this posting is Saturday, we're going to do the one minute word that should have been posted on the second of this month. And the second uh, of this month, that word was actually going to be planner and calendars. Now, I know this seems really mundane. I know y'all are thinking, Jen, what is that even about? But it's about this. When you begin to truly take your writing seriously, it may take a planner to keep everything straight. Now, I know everybody's clip is not my, like mine or the other writers who I roll with on this particular app. <clears throat> but the one thing I want to remind you is organization as a writer is key. It will save you time. It will save you effort. It will save you energy. And it will remind you to keep sane when everything else is spinning around you. If anything, have a particular place where you organize your thoughts as far as um, as far as when things are due, when you want to start things, particularly co collaborations, and set up an email as it relates to or, cor or that will correspond to your particular scheduling app. Now, I have an iPhone, so I have a particular email account that all my events and collabs, everything goes there for reminders. So as as rudimentary as you rudimentary as you may think that that is, it's actually really important. OK because we're going toward the end of 2020 and this year has been has been something that Rod Serling would grin at. So with that in mind, take the time now to get your 2021 organized, okay? I already believe in you. I'm already rooting for you. Happy writing.